PSG number one, PSG and Italy number one, and his wife were victims of a violent burglary, which they were both tied up and stripped. Financial damages are estimated at 500,000. The victims who were tied up managed to take refuge in a hotel located not far from their home. Around 3.20 a.m., the staff of the establishment then alerted the police and took care of the couple who were in shock. The 24-year-old Italian goalkeeper and his partner were taken to the hospital for treatment. The perpetrators are still on the, r- on the run, sending all our love and strength to the Donnarumma family. That is a shame. That is crazy that this happened to um, Donnarumma. I wonder where they were. Oh, he said near their home. Um, I mean, it, it could, I guess, be Paris or Italy. It doesn't matter. I was just curious. Um, so we'll have to find that out. Paris is actually pathetic. So it was in Paris, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, anyway, well, what a shame. We are wishing... Oh, my God. Strength, for sure, to Donnarumma and his family. I mean, that. what an insane ordeal to go through. Um, again, no matter who it is or whatever, to... Um, to go through something like this is is absolutely brutal for him and his partner. Um, oh, I'm sorry, him and his wife. Um, uh, that's so sad. What a shame. And we are watching. Ugh, that sucks, man. Poor, poor Donnarumma. Poor Donnarumma. Wish him the best. Wish him the best. Um. Hopefully, he's able to come out with a statement, you know, making sure that he is all right. I'm sure he'd still be at the hospital, um, not only for treatment, but I'm sure for shock. Uh, You know, they're going to probably hold him, but that's crazy that this happened. That, what a crazy story. Um, Glad he's okay, though. Glad he's okay. He can replace things. I'm sure he has insurance on stuff. Um... That's the least of their concern right now. Wishing all the best to the Donnarumma family for sure. Pray for them. 